Hello and welcome to another Excel demo with Rich Kerr. In this scenario, I have a list of uh, flights or the number of flights for given airlines at three airports. Now, my issue is that I have a total row for three airports. I've got a LAX row, a JFK row, and an ATL row. But I need to put the totals in quickly. And I don't want to manually write the subtotal or some formula. So we're going to use a keyboard shortcut to speed this process up. So I'm going to select from B6 over to E6. And I'll use the keyboard shortcut of Alt and the equal symbol together. So Alt equals will automatically put in the sum formula for the cells above. And it did it across for all of the columns where I had selected cells. So all the way from uh, column B all the way over to column E. And it did it with one single keyboard shortcut. Let's do that again, but for the JFK row. So I'll select from B10 over to E10. And again, Alt equals. And it puts my formulas in. Let's do the same thing for ATL. And we'll do Alt equals. And now I have totals in for each airport. So that was really fast and saved me a lot of time. Now, I want to do one more thing. <clears throat> I'd like to structure this with an outline so that I can quickly hide or display the detailed data. So since I have the sum formulas in these rows in between the detailed data, we'll be able to use Excel's um, auto outline function. So let's go to the group button which is found on the data tab of the ribbon. And within the group feature, we'll choose auto outline. And it looks at my data set and it sees where the total rows are. So it has put these minus signs next to each total row so that you can collapse them. So when you click that little minus symbol, it will collapse the detailed data and show you just the, the totals for each airport. And you can go back and expand those one at a time with the plus symbols. Now you can do that on mass for the entire group with the number one and two buttons at the top. So level one takes me back to everything being collapsed down. Level two goes back out to showing me the details. So that's how we can quickly add uh, a sum or subtotal row to a list like this and then quickly outline it so we can hide and show the details. I hope you find this useful. Please check in again soon for more Excel demos with Rich Kerr. Have a productive day.